Well, it is my honor to be here right now with Barbara Backgard. Hi. Hello. Barbara is the <laughs> co-founder of Vera Bradley and the creator of this foundation event. Co-creator, too. Co -creator, yeah, yes. Pat Miller. Pat Miller and me. Yeah, yeah, that's so wonderful. You guys have been at this for a long time for a bit cause. Yes. Um, Mary Sloan, who was one of our first sales reps with Vera Bradley, and she was my college roommate and we lost her to breast cancer. And she had lost her grandmother and her, her mother, and we said, okay, this has to stop here. And Pat and I were, we say ready, fire, aim. We knew nothing about running a golf tournament. <laughs> and um, we just said, we're gonna have one, we did it, and here we are 28 years later. Wow. Um, we started pledging, we started with a pledge of a million two, which we thought was like reaching for the sky. And here we are over 38 million right now. So it's an army of incredible women and oh, our, our er, everything, our steering committee, our volunteers, it's just, it's incredible, yes. Yeah. Yeah, that is so wonderful. And we are at the Vera Bratley Classic, which is a full weekend long event. This yeah. is the premier event of fall here in yeah. Fort Wayne. Yeah. And you're bringing out women for a good cause. Oh, I know. I know. It's so fun. And we had pickleball, you know, mm -hmm. the last two days. We give amazing prizes. And the beauty of it, is, the doctors come from Indiana University. That's where the research is done. However, I want to point out what they have accomplished that goes all over the world country mm -hmm. you know it's not just you don't think of it as just Indiana mm -hmm. so we've been very blessed with um, we know we've saved lives we have a young woman here right now who spoke last night she'll speak again tonight who they had literally she had been told she had about 12 weeks to live and she got into a, a study that was sponsored at IU through Vera Bradley and she's alive here she is three years later healthy oh. alive and and Yes. So we know lives have been saved. We might have lost Mary, but lives have been saved. Yes. And that's yes. what it's all about. That yeah. is. That's yeah. what it's all about. And throughout this weekend, I mean, there's over 2,000 and 500 guests that come yeah. out. There's pickleball, there's golf tournaments, yeah. and the big gala that's happening tonight. Yeah. And how, how do you feel when you see the room and the, and the course and just everybody gathering? for the cause of breast cancer research. It, it really is rewarding, but women are like that. You know, one reason we've had such um, strides in cures for breast cancer is because of the army of people, women that have survived. See, we have an army, a lot of diseases. I was talking to one of the doctors from IU yesterday. You take some things, pancreatic cancer, maybe ALS, other diseases, they don't have the hope that we have with breast cancer. Mm -hmm. But part of it is because when you look around and see survivors, you're more apt to really fight for a cause. That's mm -hmm. what it's all about. Yes. And um, we're, no, we're very proud of it. And, you know, we can't take credit. We had the idea, but like everything else we've done, Vera Bradley, <laughs> the hotel, all yes. that stuff. You, you have someone come up with the idea and then you have everyone else do everything <laughs> for you, which works for us. Yes. And um, yeah, it's it's incredible. We I love it. I'm very proud of it. Yes. And what I love most is the fact that typically you would see a breast cancer walk or yeah, marathon yeah. or just something. But this is a different twist. This is oh, creativity yeah. and having women come out and play 18 hole, nine yeah. hole golf tournaments, as we say at pickleball, and they get into the theme here. Oh my God. And they're not <laughs> golfers necessarily. It's not about it's not about right. your score. It's about your outfit. Exactly. So we give a prize for the most creative. And it's so fun because you see women in everything from tutus to golf shirts and even the scorekeepers, the men will have on bright pink shirts. And um, I looked out uh, at my home, Bruce Ewing does my landscaping and their gardeners were all wearing pink. I mean, it's uh, everyone, really, you're wearing pink, yes. of course. And Favorite color. Yeah, <laughs> everyone uh, really embraces it and it is 
it's really rewarding. Yes, Love it. Yeah. Yes. And we are matching, Barb and I, oh, so you have yeah, to get that. Ooh. And it's not easy for me to find pink in my wardrobe. <laughs> I think I wear the same thing every year, but it doesn't matter. No <laughs> one's looking at me. Yeah. No. But some of the um, outfits, you know, the foursomes, what they wear is, yeah. it, it's really cute. They're incredible. They so what? themes. Yeah, mm -hmm. they have themes and they get uh, rated best dressed. Oh, yeah. More so than who wins the tournament. We don't care. <laughs> we don't care what they shot. Mm -mm. It's all about, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's really fun. So tell me, Barb, what can we look forward to at the gala tonight? Tonight we'll be at Fort Wayne Country Club, and it's um, it's just a beautiful evening, beautiful flowers. We're all into the visual, um, and we love that. You know, the table settings, the flowers, we have nice um, um, swags, call it, but what the, what the guests leave with. Mm -hmm. um, we have a couple speakers. We keep the speaking to a minimum mm -hmm. because it's more about all of us getting together. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, yeah, I it's it's that. great. It's a beautiful, and we're so lucky with this weather. Thank yes. God for the weather. <laughs> it was iffy, right? But in 28 years, we've only been rained out once. Really? Yes. So really, we oh must have goodness. a good team up there, you know, because Absolutely. something works for us. Yes. Yeah. Well, so. this is a good cause. It's yes. a fun day, fun event. If you want to learn more about the Vera Bradley Foundation, their upcoming events, ways that you can get involved by volunteering, yes. donating, and all of that good stuff, be sure to check out their website. And we <laughs> will appreciate it, believe me. Yes. yes. Living Local 15, proudly driven by the Kelly Automotive Group.